What is going on guys, today we are looking at whatever's come out, hopefully we have got a footies vote, um, it is Wednesday and they've changed the middle, footies vote on the top left, so we have got a footies vote, uh, pack offers, weekly objectives, same as, same as, um, I don't see anything different in that bottom left, uh, choose the winner, select your free nominations, obviously it's coming out on Friday, uh, what have we got then, we have got... Second chance. Okay, okay. Um, Draxler, Savage, Florenzi. Okay. So, Draxler would be nice because obviously we do have uh, Goretzka who's, who came out again for relatively cheap. <clears throat> Florenzi would be nice. Obviously, you've got that linkable factor uh, with a few Italian players. Verratti uh, being one in the league. Un. Um who else have you got Italian-wise, though? I think that's it. Other than that, obviously, special-wise, there's probably a couple more. You've got Savic, who obviously got Matic, but hasn't really got any special cards this year, uh, but would be an absolutely insane card. That'd be what it's got to be like. Well, he's, got, he's got a foot birthday, I think, that's 89, I want to say, or something like that. Um, so it's got to be like a 90, 93, 94 card. Florenzi also has an 89 card, which, again... Would be insane. I'm thinking. Who's taller? We'll go. With, we'll go with who's taller. I'd like Draxler, but I just don't think he's going to get the vote. Six three for Savage. Six two for Draxler. In fact, I'm going to go with Draxler. To be honest, I, I really. I think with him having that kind of that uh, tall factor and obviously linking with Goretzka would be very nice to see. Pack wise, what have they got? We've got a voting days SBC. That that's always brilliant. We have got premium gold packs again, 13%, so it's not dropped, which is always good. SBC-wise then, so we already know we've got a vote. Um, let's have a look at live. We have got footies vote, icons still there, team of the week. So that is it for today. So literally just the voting and then packs. Is there anything else? Let's just have a look at the league, see if they've done anything else in any of the leagues just in case they've decided to do some of the minor leagues as well i know they've done obviously all of the major leagues i don't think they're going to be doing any of the the minors as i think they should have done that by now uh but i'm just thinking just in case they drop it and we don't see it or something like that uh by the looks of it we're all we're all the same so literally the only thing out today is the voting day um, obviously, we've got the icon in front of the four days. Uh, Van Dyke's a very nice SBC in general. Um, I think that's going for around about five to six hundred. So same as normal, we've got a prime gold players pack with um, two rares needed. That's that's all you need. What chem do you need? Forty five. Um, so we're going to put all of the untradeables that you get, obviously, from uh, from just grinding this game with the bronze packs and everything like that. So that's always nice. Was it a rating as well? It was seventy eight, in fact, as well. Uh, so we'll just put all these in as well, um, and then we'll look at a few of the higher rated. Here we go. Look, so what 78s have we got? Uh, so we want you in. We'll uh, we'll go with these as well. Lovren's untradeable. Go with you, and we'll just put all of these 78s, uh, 77s in as well, um, just so we've got a good chance of it being 78. Um, so we've got 76. So I'll put him there. We'll put you in the CDM role. We've got 77 so far. Uh, we'll go with left mid. He doesn't do it. He doesn't do it. There we go. Um, so we drop maybe one of the... So there we go. So it's pretty much there. 45, Kim. That's it. Perfect. Absolutely smashed it. Well, tradables are the best thing to use, obviously, with them. Uh, no value on them for gold uh, players as well. So they're practically it's practically a free pack from literally just doing the bronze pack method. And it's it's fantastic. So what do we get in this? Um, I don't think we got... Have we had much, really? We don't get a walkout in this one, unfortunately. Uh, we don't even get a boards in this one, in fact, as well. So that's not great. But we do have some packs. I'm going to weigh up the... Uh, the opportunity to actually use them um let's have a look then so what have we got we've got what is it premium premium gold players so 12 gold free rare um obviously 13 percent team of the season uh want to watch screams we have five of them which would be what 125k yeah yeah my maths is right there um so is it worth it we'll, we'll try a couple we'll try a couple because packs are just so easy to do at the minute um first one no walkout 
We do get a boards at least, that's always nice. Um, we get Spanish, we get centre mid. It's going to be Trigueros, 83 rated. Um, again, you can make your money back pretty easily on these. Um, I'm going to keep them in the club, but if, you, if I just show you what I mean by that, you've got, say, what, 3.5, 4k for that one. So that's, what, almost 4 or 5k of the pack already gone. Um, so you've got 5k, you, then you've got... So what is he? He's about, what, two? No, he's about, about 1K, so you've got 6K. Um, these won't go for much. So 6K, 6 and a half. Um, if you go here, you've got 6 and a half, so you've got about 7. Uh, obviously, center back. You're looking at a K again, really. Um, again, another K. Y you probably will make it back over the long run. Obviously, all it takes is one um, team of the season or one special card that would be worth the whole pack and then you just sell everything else we don't get a walk out in this one we're just going to skip and we're just going to go through them um but it basically hopefully we do get a walk out which makes it pretty much worth it um all of these players obviously you can just go ahead and sell um and it will you've got your chance of getting someone big nine times out of ten um you may get one walk out from them like this and we go again and get a oh it's a road to the final german goalkeeper and that is uh, Farman, 86, 86 rated. He's practically already paid for half of this pack already. Um, so there is that. Um, so what, we got 86. So he's 10k discard. Um, he goes for what? Probably about 19k, I want to say. Oh no, 15, 14. So he goes for 13. So if I put him up for, say, 12 and a half, or in fact, 13, 250 with that, that's already half of this pack, plus all of these, as well as then, obviously, it will pay for the later packs. More than likely, you need about two or three walkouts from them. Um, we don't go back to back, uh, but that's all it takes. One special, um, and to be honest, packs are easy at the minute. Bronze pack method is absolutely coming in clutch for me. Um, you, you can't lose money on it, and I'll show you what I mean um, once we've done this final one. I can probably guess it's not going to be a walkout, and yet I stand... Not corrected. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a bit of a dead day, to be honest. I don't know if there's actually a new Team of the Week out as well. Um, we'll have a quick look. Uh, we'll just whack all these in. Um, team of the Week-wise, do we actually have any Team of the Weeks? Let's have a look. Um, no, I don't think we do. What is the age? What is, uh, what is Twitter saying? Um, so there are all the packs done. Um, again, very, very simple to do. Um, we have, have we not got anything else whatsoever? Um, so if we search for EA, have they dropped anything? I know obviously they dropped the career mode uh, pitch notes and everything like that. We don't have anything Team of the Week related. Um, I'm still waiting for that 87 Twitch pack. I don't know when that's coming. Um, that That's something that really needs to be out soon. Um, I think what you've got until, what was it, the 9th of August. So that's Friday. So they may drop it Friday. Uh, you never know. Finish one, drop the other. Um... Apart from that, that's everything content-wise. Obviously, in the Foot Central, you'll find that, obviously, we've got the Footies nomination, which is always good. Two uh, rare gold player. Um, again, you just use one of your players uh, that you picked in a normal beginner SBC, uh, um, squad battle, and you get yourself a, a free rare player pack. I think I got Zapata from one of them. So, they are worth doing sometimes. But what I mean by the bronze pack method, I was going to do a kind of like a separate video on it. But I thought, you know what? There's no content. We'll kind of touch on it a little bit. So 400 coins, as you see, uh, we'll just skip, skip the pack. That's all you want to do. Um, you literally cannot lose money on this. It is, if as long as you do it for a little bit, it will make you money. So first off, we've got the rare. You see there straight away. What's that? That's say what? 2.5k. I'm going to put him up there. Lowest on the market by like 300 coins. Two and a half K. That's four, eight, one, two, uh, one, six, one, six. Yeah, that's right. One, six, uh, two K, two, two, four. So it pays for six packs already. Then you've got the MLS players. So anyone in the major leagues, you don't have to put these up. Personally, I do just to make that extra bit. Um, any of the major leagues still just put up because more than likely they sell. So that pack, we've used 400 coins and we've gained, what, two and a half um, two seven basically so we've already paid for just shy of seven packs in one player 
you continuously do that. You look at the major leagues like this. Um, some of them will be 200. You look at these, uh, some of the times the Japanese at the minute, I think they're in marquee matchups. You like look at that one. Going for around about 750, I'm going to put him up for. Again, there's two packs. I keep all of the other players because obviously they're going to go into silver upgrades or bronze upgrades, in fact, um, and then into silver upgrades once you've opened them. Um, so you literally cannot lose money. I've been doing this for all week and I've made an abundance amount of coins. Sometimes you will get nothing. Um, obviously, there is sometimes uh, where you won't get any major leagues, any players that you can sell. All the rares go. Um, you look there, 750. So literally, I have in, at this moment, I've not lost anything on this on a, buying a pack. Um, 200 for the Dutch. Um, so again, there's what, 850, 950 with the 100 coins that we got as well. Sometimes you can get a bronze pack in these as well. So there's always that as well as going on top of it. Um, you've got fitnesses. I sell personally for a K. Um, and then you've got um, the pace cards, which is the attribute cards. They go for, I'm going to say, 200 um, at the time of doing this. Um, so, so we got him for 350. Uh, we go, say, what, 300 for him. Um, sometimes the chi Chinese have been going up a little bit. Um, get rid of anyone duplicate that's not Major League. He's going to be 200. And you kind of get the gist. This is it. Literally, spam 100 in your items and you are bound to make money off it. It's just a method that's going to happen to work. It's worked all year round. Um, obviously, I think this this point in time, it's working a lot better than it ever has done. Um, as you see here, so we go... 1k with the squad fitness um, again just keep relisting personally i relist about three or four times uh, or to be honest it depends i relist just constantly um just until they sell because eventually they will sell as long as you're not desperate for coins this is a very long process but it's it's there and it's constant you see here this is another good example we've got what a chinese uh, rare player going for i'm going to say two i'm going to say two two um you could whack him up for two four if you wanted to get that little bit of extra money um but we've got two two for him then we've got 200 for him so that's what two six then we go down a bit we've got 100 there so two seven two eight and then obviously you do get the coins for discarding um stuff so that does add up that's an extra 24 coins it's all about them pro them little profit margins and you just keep that going, literally keep that going. Um, as you'll see, we've got quite a few already. Um, and then I think I've got a lot of uh, unsold at the minute just because I need to kind of work on the pricing and everything like that. Um, but a lot of players already going for quite a bit. You'll see, you just keep relisting. Um, obviously, some of these are a little bit high on price. Um, like I can imagine you've probably dropped down a little bit. He was going for 9K, um, but... Sometimes you just have to take that a little bit less and just keep going like that. For me, it's probably one of the best methods that we've got um, at this minute in time as well. I think that is the main thing. Um, one's already sold. So 750 already from one of them Japanese players. So that's already two packs paid for. It's that easy. Literally, there is no other way. I think at this moment in time, that's probably one of the best ways to make coins. Um, so definitely check in on that. And apart from that, I think that is everything. I was kind of hoping for some sort of SBC, but we haven't got one as of yet. And I'm still debating what foot swaps to get. Um, I'm really unsure of what I actually want. Fabinho would be very, very nice, but it's obviously waiting quite a while. Um, not really fussed on the Prime Icon pack, uh, but I'm thinking... I do like some of these as well. I do like that Sanchez. I think he's very nice. And at the minute, with having 93 Alaba, 92 Goretzka, it'd be nice to have that final 90 buy-in uh, midfield going on. Um, apart from that, Courtois looks very nice. Um, and then a couple of these, like Zaha looks really good. But I think I should have probably got that straight away. Um, so I'm thinking one of either one of these... Um, Manolox looks alright, but to be honest, he's not really going to get in. Uh, Paulson looks very nice as a super sub. So I think it's going to be a choice between Paulson and Fabinho. Um, so I'm going to kind of 
going to decide which one I want, which one to go for. Um, obviously, we've got a few of the foot swaps to keep on doing at the minute. But apart from that, hopefully you enjoyed. Um, there's nothing else, so we're going to check back tomorrow. Obviously, reviews. I think we had Quag out earlier today. Um, so we're going to get more reviews out going out. I think Hazard's next tomorrow. Um, I know, again, it's a little bit late, but we're just trying to keep it up and keep it going. Um, we're going to be buying loads of special cards to fit in some teams to do some more reviews. So hopefully you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe with the bell button on, and I'll see you all for the next one. Peace.